All right, let's uh, go explore more of this underwater world we're in here. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Nobody knows my sorrow. <laughs> Gee, I wonder how many golden pipes Freddy and Luther have now. I sure hope you're right. Oh. Cool. Excuse me, sir. Did you lose your wallet? No, Proposal Brevi, no. Told you, Freddy. It doesn't belong to anyone. We can keep it. I don't think so, Luther. We will find the owner. Cool. I wonder what will happen if I gave him this, uh... Old Soggy Sniffer just ain't what it used to be. He's going to need all three golden pipes before he can pick up the scent. Oh, okay. Oh my. Step right up, gills and buoys, for the most amazing carnival under the sea. You remember the terrific tumble tooth ride last year? Well, what we've got in store for you this year is even better. Oh wow. Did you see anything unusual near the great conch shell yesterday? Could be wrong, son, but I do declare. I believe I saw rosy pearls swimming by near there. <laughs> Is he rhyming now? <laughs> Tired of going belly up at parties? Is scorn the only thing you spawn? Don't get in a snit when you can score a hit here at Gil Barker's Floating Fun. If you've got four purple sea urchins, just fork over the dough and in you go. You'll come out a winner or my name isn't Broccoli Bob. But your name isn't Broccoli Bob. Don't bother me with details, son. <laughs> Let's go in there. Looks like fun. Oh, my. Wow, it's a Grandma Grouper fortune teller machine. are often deceiving. Wow, that's really deep. Great things are in store for you. I wonder which store they're talking about. <laughs> I don't think I meant that literally. It sounds like it's in the key of F. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me?
because simplicity is the essence of beauty. Please, take this orange sea urchin as thanks for returning my possession. Great, because money is the essence of wealth. That was cool. You know, the real Elvis Presley did that best. Honestly. Neat. Let's try and get... These kelp vines are too thick for us to get past. Ah. Ah. That tastes horrible. If we can find... 
find someone who likes to eat this type of kelp, then we can get through this doorway. Hmm. Is that all there is? You want world peace? Yes, sir. You want bulging pectoral fins and thin thighs? Well, tuck nuggies, you won't get that here. But for only four purple sea urchins, what you will get is a chance to prove your skill and have a thrill at Gil Barker's world famous floating fun. It's the perfect game for a fish with a sharp eye and a steady fin. That sounds like you, Freddy. So she's not only cute, but she can also shoot. Well, let's have four purple sea urchins and you can show us your stuff. Here's a purple sea urchin. That's just one purple sea urchin. I need three more before you guys get through the door. Another purple sea urchin for you. Purple sea urchin number two, but that ain't gonna do. Two purple sea urchins more bring the total to four. Here's another purple sea urchin. That's three purple sea urchins, and I'm one away from having enough to let you play. Here's our last purple sea urchin. Four purple sea urchins, precisely the price of admission. And fortunately for you, too, uh, having a special. For every little yellow fish that pays admission, a little green fish gets in absolutely free. Boy, did I ever hit this on the right day. Critters up the wall. When enough of the same critters touch each other, they'll go away. If you use all the critters in the tube, you'll advance to a new level. But watch out. When the critters move above the bar, they won't go away. Oh, I think I get it now. minigame. Cool. Oh, I can do go over. <clears throat> this plastic shovel isn't strong enough 
to keep the clam from clamming up. Oh, okay. Hmm. Wonder where I should go next. Oh, I know what I should do. <clears throat> Excuse me. I know where we can use that. Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper that's been giving horse feather so much trouble is what you want? I'd be glad to give you to it. Thank you, Mr. Feather, sir. Cool. Still the great conch shell. 
the Barker Gill to himself all the customers he wants. Maybe the great conch shell he stole. I'll continue after this.